Well, we're down by the west side of the Green River in Kent, Washington. And this is our pair of bald eagles. They've been here all winter. They winter out year-round. They're here, the residents. They nest here. We don't know where the nest is for sure, but they're enjoying the sunshine today, sitting together in their favorite tree. And the Green River is almost right below them. And if a fish would come by, they'd sail down and get it. But we're just uh, a little ways from the Boeing Aerospace Building in Kent, Washington. There's a big red barn. It's got a race track there, track for their horses, and they board horses here. Eagles can be seen here in this. It's a lovely call. That's their call. Probably telling me to get out of here, but <laughs> we're going to sit here and make a little short movie, then we'll leave them alone. But uh, people walk around down here, they're not really afraid of people, so that's pretty good. Oh, yeah, they're singing now. Springtime, they're getting all excited. give them a chance here and uh, we'll go on and see if we can find the peregrine falcons. They hunt here also. So we'll call that good then. Over and out and bye bye. Well here's a pair of bald eagles. We're down at uh, Kent, Washington. Right next to the Green River. And these two love birds are sitting up here in the tree. They didn't locate their nest this spring, but we know they nest here somewhere, and this is their favorite perch. And they sit up here in the tree and they check out uh, the river for fish and salmon. And they're looking around really intent here. We have some nice sunshine today, and uh, they decide to sit up the top of their tree and uh, look for some fish. And if one comes in the river, they'll just sail down and catch it. We had quite a bit of rain again last night, but it looks like it's clearing off now, so we're all excited about that. Get out and see what the birds are doing in the area. And like I say, we're just lucky we found these two bald eagles pair sitting up here in the top of the fir tree. We enjoy that very much. We had a green heron the other day, and we're gonna go down and see if we can locate him. We saw the peregrine falcon yesterday taking a bath down by the Boeing Aerospace Building, so... We're going to spend the day down here this afternoon, see if we can uh, find maybe a cooper hawk. We saw an immature cooper hawk a couple of days ago fly over and land on the pole, so... We're trying to locate that one. bald eagle looking over the shoulder here at us so maybe we'll call that good then and uh, go over and see if we can locate some of the other birds of prey in the area anyway these are a pair of bald eagles and we're happy to have found them so a couple of good looking birds we'll call that good then I think I can zoom in I'll try zoom in a little more get on that one there oh yeah I zoom in too much. Well, that's fairly good there, so we'll call that good then. Over and out. Well, here's our pair of resident bald eagles. We call this pair George and Martha. <laughs> kind of a cute little name. We have a little fun with that. Anyway, they're right next to the Green River. And this is one of their favorite trees. They sit up on top and they're looking for the salmon. And they fly over and catch fish every day, so... We're not sure where they nest. It's close by here, I'm sure, because we see them here all the time, but... We always enjoy making a movie of them, and today they're in a tree where we can see most of their bodies, and... Uh, they're just right next to the river, and we're keeping an eye out for them, and thought we'd make a little video. I've been watching the peregrine falcons down here hunting ducks in the area also, and... We also have seen merlins in the area and of course some cooper hawks so we have plenty of crows of course they're everywhere but anyway this is our pair of bald eagles they're looking really good giving us their good profile shots today and 
I'm just kind of sitting on my tailgate here with a hatchback open and they're kind of unconcerned because they hang out next to the horse barn they have where they stable horses and they have a track and the people are pretty busy there and it doesn't seem to disturb them so they've gotten really used to people and uh, 